Hey everybody, and welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Here we are at the last round, just like I promised. Let's go in and negotiate a truce with the Anarchs, or if possible, a war against the Camarilla. I'm not quite sure. Jack's gone. Uh, you're still hanging out. Does that say exhaust pipe? Damsel? I'll probably have to talk to Damsel because I don't think there's anybody else here. Heard anything? Yeah. Um. I'm gonna just let's lay it all out, Damsel. Uh, the leader of the Quijin recently told me of an alliance with Lacroix. Lacroix wants to go to war with them. He needs an alliance with the Anarchs. Calm down, all right? The blood hunt with Nines is off. Zhao killed Grout. She's a shapeshifter. We told him Nines didn't do it. That son of a... And that crazy bitch. If I ever get my hands on her, I'll tie her eyelash to her ass hair and pull her ass into a car compactor. Demon! Oh, whore! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Just calm down, damsel. I'm, I'm really sorry. Is there any way I can talk to Nines? Okay, all right. I'm fine. Nines, yeah. I can't believe it's coming this. Oh, I hate those goddamn devils anymore than I hate that fascist dandy prince. Wow. Right now, we can skank sushi. <laughs> <laughs> Damsel, over here. Just tell me where Nines is. I know you're cool, so Nines is hiding out in the I don't know about this alliance stuff though. Thanks, Damsel. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it. Uh, Alright. That's actually, and that whole um, eating something to vomit, that's a, a vampire blood, uh, kind of a, a role-playing game note. So vampires, especially vampires with high humanity, can eat food. It just doesn't digest because the cultures in their body don't digest it. They don't have any stomach acid. Their body's inert. So anything a vampire eats to keep up appearances, drinking coffee, hanging out with people, whatever... Um, they have no appetite for it. They can force themselves to do it, but they then eventually have to throw it up because there's nowhere else for it to go. So that's particularly unpleasant, I suppose. All right. Griffith Park, huh? I don't know where that is, so I'm just going to hope the taxi driver does. I'm really hoping I can manipulate this situation into the Anarchs taking over, but I, I don't know if this game has multiple endings. Yeah, man, let's go. Oh, no. Am I... Oh, I hope I'm not leading LaCroix into a trap. Or Nines into a trap. I, I don't know. I'm not equipped for this. I don't have enough ammo and weapons. I should... Oops. I should have gone and got weapons before I went. But I really just wanted to go up here and I'm sick of running around and doing errands. Hmm. Really? Is this necessary? I mean, I guess to get to the remote safe house. I have a feeling the game programmers were like, dude, I really want to do a cable car. And the programmers were just like, whatever, we have like a week before we shift the game. Go ahead, just do it. It'll be fine. Ooh. Wow, this is a really tall cable car. There's, there's downtown. You can see the giant LaCroix building that goes basically up into space. That's a really cool background that they posted, though. That's really neat. All of Santa Monica up there. Hey, 
Hey Nines, what's up? Heard a lot about you. You've been a big help to the cause out here. I appreciate it. So LaCroix needs us all of a sudden, huh? Yeah. He needs the Anarchs to get rid of the Quajin. Does he now? You know, we just ended a war with them and we lost a lot of people. Too many. Does he expect us to do all the fighting while the Camarilla throws mean looks from the sidelines? Or are they ready to go toe to toe with those goddamn devils? Uh, they're willing to do whatever it takes to make the Alliance happen. I still don't trust LaCroix. But then again, the Camarilla didn't wholesale slaughter us upon arrival. God damn it. I'm stuck between a rock and a son of a bitch. You are not wrong. Um. <sighs> your people need a leader right now more than ever. Mm. It seems strange. LaCroix wanting to go to war against them all of a sudden. Something's not right. I agree. We can't trust the prince. Not what I mean, kid. Smell that? Smells like smoke. We gotta get out of here. What? What do you mean? Kid, we've been followed. Fuck! That fire's coming from all directions. It's man-made. We gotta get out of here. This is bad. Shit. Alright. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No, kid. You don't understand. The fire wasn't set to kill us. Come on. We gotta get to the tram. Alright, let's go. I didn't hide out here because it was a nice view. I did it because no one would come looking for me in these parts. This is werewolf country. Fuck. The wolves are gonna be out for blood. Excuse me. I'm so sorry, Brian. Come on, move. Yeah, let's stop talking about it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Werewolves. Go. No. Let's go. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Shit. I just want to run. Come on, kid. We gotta get inside that building until it comes back. Well, shit. Well, sh double shit. They just took... They just took nines. Nines is gone. What am I gonna do now? That guy's real mad. Oh, man. Alright. I... I am woefully unprepared. Go! Close the door. Close the door. Maybe they can't open doors. They can definitely open doors. They can definitely open doors. Alright, this will be fine. This will be fine. I'll just hang out up here. It'll be fine. I'm gonna get my celerity out, uh, just in case. Who's this dude? Just nothing. Check power? What? Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, okay, buddy. You just pick a side. You just pick a... You pick wherever you want to go, and I will just go wherever that isn't. Alright? I mean, it'll be like passive-aggressive roommates. You just... You just do your thing, and I'll just do my thing, and I will just stay out of the house whenever you're in the living room. Okay? Alright? I think... I think that's good. Let's turn on the power. Alright, power on. That's nice. What do we got? Can I go in here? Okay. Uh, whoa. All right. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. What is this? What am I doing? Okay, I'm opening it to the full moon. All right. I wish I could close that door. He'd never... Well, he could just climb up this outside. I don't really understand what the point of that was. Because now I'm outside and it doesn't help anything. I'll just, I'll just run around. I'll just, you know, I'll just use that time-honored video game trick of just just running around. I mean, because turning the, turning the lights on was nice, but it really doesn't affect anything. And here's the tram station. We've got about half our time left. All right. Uh, oh, oh, hi. Hey, um, do you mind if... Alright, I'll just... Okay, I'll stop using your Netflix account. I'm really sorry. Just, I'll just... I promise. I'm not gonna do it anymore. I know I watched 13 and a half seasons of reality shows. It's... I know that's all it thinks you want to watch now, but please, just leave me be. I was really sad. It was a long weekend. I'll just hide out over here until he comes and gets me. I know he can see me. There's no sense in doing this. 
Maybe he can't. All right, well, I'll just hang out. It's kind of pretty. The falling ash from the entire burning forest is pretty nice. So yeah, you guys see any good movies? I watched The Last Starfighter recently, again, and that movie just gets better now that I'm older because I can get more of the jokes. It's the, for those of you that don't know, it was like a really early science fiction movie that used 3D animation before that was really prevalent, and it's kind of just a vehicle to do cool fight scenes, but it is actually a pretty clever show, pretty clever movie. Um, a kid gets recruited into an alien space force by playing and getting the high score on a video game, and it's right outside of his trailer park. So that's definitely the thing that happened. <laughs> uh, whew, here we go. All right. Got to just book it back to the, what do you call it? I guess the tram stop. Okay, okay. Excuse me. Sorry, coming. Alright, you know what would be really cool? Being able to get on that cable car. Right now. Go, 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 go. Well, that sucks. I sure hope Nines isn't dead. I mean, we didn't see him die but I sure hope he isn't dead. <coughs> Excuse me. You know, werewolves do get pretty damn mad when you burn down their forests. And LaCroix is an asshole. He's just trying to take out everybody. I've had quite enough of this. Hmm. All right. Now that we're more or less safe, once we get to the ground here, I'm gonna take a quick save just to make sure everything is going well. Maybe, maybe I will, come on. Wonderful. All right, let's just save real quick here. Okay, that's plenty good enough. Let's, hey man. Thanks, Jack. I'm glad that you're here, even though those nines just got killed on my watch. <sighs> Friends forever, I guess. Where are we? are we? We're in my Santa Monica hideout. I can tell by all of the posters. Wake up. Look alive, kid. You better be on your feet and ready to move. What's, what's going on, man? Get ready to run. Take everything you need. You're never coming back here. What happened? LaCroix put out the word. He says you're in league with the Kuei Jin, Ming Xiao's puppet. That you're the one who set up nines for her. See, he's thinking it all out. And now your death is a big bullet point in his new unity campaign. There's a blood hunt on you. I'm in league with the Kuei Jin? He had to turn things around on you real quick since you found out about his deal with Ming Xiao. This is his plan B. Plan A was to kill you with nines in Griffith Park. Now LaCroix is playing the victim. The way he tells it, you were like his own child. He entrusted you with so much. And you took full advantage, sold out to the Quay Jin, and cost that the guy. their hero. They're saying nines is dead, and you killed him. Bastard, after... <sighs> Why would he? It doesn't make any sense. You know that? Come on. Look, I'm here to help you. Again. But damn it, it's time. Time for what? Time to make a choice. Did Nines make it out of Griffith Park? I hope you live to find out. The hell am I supposed to do? You're gonna have to stay off the street and stay on the move. And it's open season on your ass. Vampire's gonna be busting in from Sacramento to join in on this hunt. All right. You need backing. You need the protection of one of the factions. Friends are the last thing you want to be without right now. But you have to get out of here. Thanks, man. I got a driver who can get you where you need to go. Interesting guy. You like him. 
But this place is being watched. He's across Santa Monica by the junkyard. Get there and he'll get you out of town. Awesome. Sounds good. All right, get running. Hope you make it out of Santa Monica at least. I'd like to see how this turns out for you. <laughs> Me too. All right. Well, take the watch that's by the toilet. I'm not really sure. Um, read my email. Death cannot smother love. Dead hearts are not always broken. Plant a kiss on my corpse. Love blossoms. Do you love it? Eh, uh, pass. Honestly, I'm getting out of town. Felt so liberating to open up to you. So I dip and pen in my soul again and write another for you. She's just writing me poems now. Father, I never knew you. Mother, I ran away from you. Sire, you forgot me. But lover, you are forever in my heart. Think my looks will stop me from being taken seriously as a poet? That's actually true. The true master has played the game, the entire game, since the first move. You know, you're not wrong. Fucking LaCroix is the, the bad guy. All right. I don't have anything else here. I mean, is there any blood in the fridge? No. I don't have enough weapons and ammo for this, but let's go. Later, Jack. I really appreciate you saving my butt. My glitched out blood pack. Nothing in the mailbox. Let's boogie. All right, we got to get across Santa Monica, back to where the Nosferatu is hiding, like that silo. That's the junkyard. Hmm. Huh. All right, here we go. You know? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 okay. You know, I'm not gonna kill you guys as of right now. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna let you, you do, you just, you know what, you do your thing. I'm gonna Usain Bolt out of here. I'm done. I'm, I'm done. Goodbye. Oh, whatever. Guess what? I don't care. I'm jumping over this. I can't. That is lame. That... The dumpster's really shallow, and look, I got one foot on it, but you can't jump over it. You just can't. That's dismal. Am I going to have to kill a bunch of vampires? Eh, there are worse things. All right, all right, let's do it. All right, character sheet. Ugh. Character sheet. Give me more melee. Give me more strength. Perfect. Where's my sword? My brand new magical sword. Come on, cool guys. You wanna go? You wanna go? Come on. I'll just fight all of you. Maybe not very effectively. Okay, this is not gonna work for me at all. <laughs> I forgot I'm still terrible at fighting. It doesn't matter if my skill is an eight. It doesn't really help in the long run. Is this after? Yeah, this is after I leveled up. No, why am I, why do I have the sword out? Time is weird in Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines because I did this and then I equipped my sword. But right here, so it remembers what equipment you're wielding, but it doesn't actually remember like your stat increases. I'm in frenzy, what is going on? Am I like beating people up? I'm not doing this. It's not me. Frenzy sucks. I'm supposed to be like this badass killing machine once I go into Frenzy, but that did not work out at all well. I didn't have any claws or anything. I just kind of like scratched people with my well manicured nails. All right, we're going to do this. We're going to put this in here one more time. Melee, strength, sword. All right, we're doing it. Swords don't run out of ammo. It's a worthy investment. Okay. Zoop. Okay, now. Okay, we're just gonna keep attacking. Come on. Yeah, there's one. You wanna keep fighting me? Come on, stop it. 
Yeah, all right, so three of them is a bit much. I, I definitely think fighting is not the answer. Violence is never the answer, except when it is the answer because video game designers are lazy. So, I try, see, I tried to make, there's no way to get in there, it's just glitching out. All right, so we're gonna just, we're just gonna boost out of here. Equip the sword, but put it away. See you guys later, Bye bye all right, um, we went down the alleys. They were blocked off. Let's go down through the parking garage. Yep, this is perfect. I'll just keep. I'll just keep running as fast as celerity can take me. That's not where I want to be. What is going on? Hey, what are you doing here? Are you just a guy? Yeah, you're just a guy. Now is not the time for you to be here. I'm so sorry. Excuse me. Oh, he's got a couple of shots off. I cannot run faster than bullets. I'm not Barry Allen. But I, I am faster than most of them. Okay, okay. Go, 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 go. Get in the cab, get in the cab, get in the cab, get in the cab. Cannot talk during combat. Hide. Nope. Come on, I need to get in the cab. All right, um, so I have to lose them before I can... All right, let's go all the way back here. Hide in this corner, and then get out my sword. This is not going well for me, but that's okay. Not losing, except I am losing. Hold on, where's Blood Heal? There, use that. He's just blocking every one of my moves. It's kind of crazy. I'm being attacked by all the other character models of, like, main character from other parts of the game. All right. That guy's going to see us, and he's going to come in here. I just know it. Also be really yeah. Just give me Alright, fine, here we go. Come here. Stop shooting me, jeez. That gun is amazing. That guy may look like Steve O from the show Jackass, but man is he good at that. Alright, so I have to fight. Um or at least be better at stealth, but the problem is there really isn't a way to hide because it seems like all of them can track you kind of implicitly. So we're gonna we're gonna whip out our our melee upgrades again. We're gonna get out our, our gun. This gun? No. Um maybe this gun? I don't know. These three people here don't have guns, so I'm gonna try to like counter whatever they have you do. So I'm gonna Okay. So here's my plan. That's not working very well at all. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I take back everything I tried. So where does this? Yeah. Okay, that works pretty good. Okay, so that was terrible. Why? How come everybody has the Gangrel discipline that gives you claws? Literally everyone. I'm. I got missed. I didn't get that memo. I wasn't allowed to have that. Very frustrating. Okay. All right. Sweet sword fight. Okay. Joop. We're gonna blood buff, and then we're gonna celerity right away. Come on. Where's celerity? There. So now I'm faster than all of you. Not really helping me so far. There we go. Now we're getting a little bit of payback for it. Keep going. Like being faster than you doesn't really help in this context. I guess Slarity's kind of lame. <laughs> I was in the middle of a jump shot, and I just became nothing. All right, um, I'm already bored of this, but if we could just escape Santa Monica, we should be okay. Shouldn't have to do this anymore. 
but um, so can you see where if you built a character that like wasn't really you weren't really preparing for combat at all you were just kind of doing your thing um, you could be really disappointed in the way this game ends I mean because this is very unavoidable I mean maybe if I was an Asperatu I would be better off here why? Gosh. I can't really do much to hurt these guys. I can grab blood from that one dude, that homeless guy, before he runs away. <coughs> <sighs> oh, yeah, I'm still getting over the last of my cold. So that was one of the reasons why I wasn't up uploading videos, is I didn't really have much of a voice to speak of. I don't really typically buy those excuses, like, oh, I was too sick to record, but, like, I was not feeling good, so... I definitely just kind of rolled over and gave up for at least a while. Okay, come on. Come on. I'll fight you all the way down at this end. Nice. Alright, so that guy with the dreadlocks, he's the one that I don't like. Yeah, alright. Because you, you're basically just a Sabat guy that I've fought like a million times. <coughs> All right, so can I go back in my house? No, my house is now locked. I have half a health bar. I'm gonna, I'm sorry, buddy. Let me just borrow some blood. Oh, no! Why did that go down so fast? <sighs> Fine. I will probably not make it through here this time anyway. So, all right, we can avoid all of those guys. We cannot avoid the people in here. Maybe we can. Maybe they're just really bad vampires. You know? Maybe they are just really bad vampires. No, oh, well. Good enough for me, man. I'll take it. Now, this guy, this guy's a pain in my butt. Stop that. I'll just beat you into a corner and then hit you with a stick a lot. Alright, and we're gonna blood heal a couple of times because this. Get out of here with that. There. All right, things are going very, very well. I'm going to just run into this corner really quick and just say over here, and just pump the healing button until I am healed. I really hate how onset, like, can you look? Like, it is not a fair transcription between how much blood I'm spending and how much healing I'm actually getting. Like, it goes up three little ticks or four little ticks. Sometimes it goes up a lot. Sometimes it doesn't. Anybody's guess what this healing actually does? Anybody's guess? All right, we're almost ready for the final battle. I'm actually kind of scared. I don't really want to do it. Um, let's grab this in. Just, just, just in case. You never know what could happen. All right. Three more bad guys to get through. Three. One of them's got that really big gun. Can I sneak? I don't think I can sneak. Am I this lucky? They're looking right at me. <sighs> I should have tried stealth a long time ago. <coughs> we could have saved so many lives if I had just tried to sneak out of that alley. I don't really think I could have. But I'm honestly not willing to discount the possibility. Where to? Anywhere but here, man. Very well. Thanks, buddy. So... <laughs> what am I? Jerry Seinfeld? I'm having a hell of a night, let me tell you. Uh, so you know Jack? Here we go. So now I get to decide whether I want to give the city to the Anarchs or whether I want to give the city to the Quajin. 
I'm beginning to think the kindred have it all wrong, Quadrin, though. Um, see, this is, this is interesting. What choice do I want to make? <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Um, I should have backed nines all along. I like the Anarchs. I haven't done anything for them, really. Um, Ming Zhao was honest with me. She came forward and talked all about all of that stuff. But she did that after messing me up and attacking me. I should have stayed with nines. Hmm. I'm extra misguided, but at least they're honest. The Camarilla's rotten. That is exactly how I feel. If the Anarchs manage to recapture this city, it will not be long before someone challenged them for it. Conflict is born of waste and actuality in their life. And it's not just you. His voice is really quiet. Um... May not be the best choice, but it's the best choice I have. The Anarch spirit exists within the blood of many. Few, though, are willing to listen to it. Perhaps they live a few years. They would not have lost so much. It's true, though. If Nines is dead, the revolution might be over. I mean, who would take it? Jack wouldn't do it. Damsel's the only strong anarch left with a name. There's that other guy who's really mad all the time and works at the bar, but I don't really think even he's got much going on. Um, better to be a secret anarch than a dead one. LaCroix's got an advantage. Well, he does, but he's an ass. And I don't like this boastful, if the Anarchs had me, they wouldn't need anyone else. That's complete poopy. That's not at all true. <laughs> Anarchs, Camarilla, Shriners. I will not want to share the fate of any group. I feel like that's just noping out of the ending. Um, I'm better to be a secret Anarch than a dead one. No, um, Beckett isn't, Beckett doesn't want it to, he doesn't know anymore. Um, no, it's something powerful though, I can tell. If all of Croy's plans hinge on Kunkel's sarcophagus, what would he and you do if there was nothing inside? Hmm. I never thought of it like that. The Anarchs are right, he's crazy. The Anarchs have not suppressed them as thought. I fear there is one more to live in <laughs> the revitalized movement. Maybe the hope is just over. <laughs> Unless it's Spider-Man, I'm not sure what big difference they'd make. No, I don't... LaCroix's a pile of poopy. I really don't like him. Um, I don't know what to do. Your sympathies seem to lie with the Anarchs. The Anarchs' passion may be their greatest strength or their Achilles' heel. But imagine if they did hold on to the free state. It could inspire others to come and together construct a new Enoch. Yeah, man. Take me to Hollywood. Let's go see. If you see the Baron of Hollywood. Passion and would share the burden of such a fire, we will go to meet the last.
last person capable of keeping them together. All right, let's do it. If that is your decision. That is my decision. I think I'm siding with the Anarchs. I think that that's the correct choice, at least for this particular character. He's the oh, he has been beaten around by everybody else. I'm still crouching. Hey, man. Good to see you, brother. You too, Skelter. This nine's alive. This is the first time you're not. You're not. They're mad at me. He's inside. The motherfucker's telling some tall tales, saying he wrestled a werewolf. You believe that shit? It's true. <laughs> it was more like a werepup. I have to take care of the big daddy. No, it's true. Yeah, whatever. And the Pope's my ghoul. Give it back. All right, thanks, Skelter. That is the wrong door. You in the swimming pool? Where am I going? Okay. Oh, what's up? Hey, damsel. Hey, you're alive. Wow. The way nine said things went down, I figured a werewolf would be cracking you out about now. I need to see nines. We need to finish this. Nines will be happy to see you made it out. I guess I am, too. But that's between you and I. Got it? I love you, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just don't get him started on that damn werewolf again. Ugh. You'd think he'd stop at telling you the story twice. I'll try not to mention All it. All right. Go on in. I'll make sure no one interrupts. Man, I hope somebody tries. Rumor is you killed me. Sorry I couldn't clear your name yet. But I knew you'd make it in here in one piece. Hell, you get out of the park alive. Quite a feat, kid. I'm looking a little bit better than you. Thought you were dead, man. You mean this guy? Can't say I got out without a scratch. Hell of a bra, though. Unfortunately, we don't have time to swap war stories. We were set up, kid. Someone tried to get rid of us, and the list of suspects is short. LaCroix or Zhao? Ming Zhao said they had an alliance. What? The Kui Jin and LaCroix? Even the Camarilla wouldn't let that fly. He wanted an alliance with me because his other one failed. That's twice they tried to get me killed. And kid, it's not gonna end there. It's us or them. You got a preference? Yeah, I do. If you're gonna take them out, you got my support. I'd like to take Zhao's heart in my hands and squeeze the black out of it. And LaCroix, he wouldn't get off so easy. But after that wolf, I'm barely in one piece. If you survived a werewolf, I bet you can handle this. And what do we do? I've already sent the troops out to raise hell all over the city. The Kuei Jin think we're busy with the camp, so... They won't be expecting an attack. You know what's got to be done, right? Say no more. Zhao's been in L.A. for too many nights. Make tonight her last. <laughs> Unless she can shake shift into a tank, I'm pulling her card. Once Zhao's out of the way, head to LaCroix's tower. You oust LaCroix, you'll be a hero in this city. I'm counting on you. Thanks, man. I won't let you down. Isaac's guaranteed me nobody's getting into Hollywood. I'll survive. But I wish I could be fighting at your side. This one's for LA, kid. No pressure. Dude, <laughs> this is awesome. <sighs> um, you have something to help me out like that grenade of yours? Just follow this street to the end. I will. Oh, he does have... Uh, there's a grenade. I was talking about wanting one of those. I'm going to drop my least useful weapon. Hold on. Why? I can't justify that. Hold on. Let's drop. I wonder. Oh, I bet you it's because that's full. Hold on. Yeah, this thing sucks. Drop that. Okay, so that doesn't matter. It's not. I wish you would be more specific. My firearm inventory is full. Okay, this pistol has done me a lot of good. I hate to drop it. This shotgun's terrible. And one grenade. Fragmentation grenade. Damage potential, 10,500. Bye, man. I'm all torn up. Rest up, buddy. Keep that shotgun. All right. Go on in. 
Bye. All right, so here we go. Good luck, brother. <sighs> All right, guys. Um, I think that this is the beginning of the end. We've got two missions left. We gotta, we gotta go beat Ming Zhao, and then we've gotta go beat Lacroix. No big deal, right? Just the two hardest bosses in the game, two biggest bad butts. I'm gonna end this episode here. I'll check back with you guys real soon, and we'll get this thing done. Take it easy.